San Clemente, California. Kareem Abdul-Jabbar's 28-year-old son was arrested earlier this week for allegedly stabbing his neighbor in San Clemente, authorities confirmed Friday. Adam Abdul-Jabbar was booked Wednesday on suspicion of assault with a deadly weapon, a spokesperson for the Orange County Sheriff's Department said. He was released on bond the same day. According to authorities, deputies responded about 10 p.m. Tuesday to a call of a stabbing in the 300 block of Calle Guaymas. The suspect was taken into custody without incident, officials said. The victim, Ray Windsor, transported himself to a hospital with multiple injuries that were not life-threatening, the sheriff's spokesperson said. Windsor told Eyewitness News that he's lucky to be alive after being stabbed seven times, the knife even puncturing his head. Residents in the area described Abdul-Jabbar as a good kid and were shocked by the alleged violence. Windsor says the confrontation started over trash cans, an ongoing issue between the two for last couple of years. I sort of got on him because the lady who takes care of him is 83 year old, he doesn't do anything for her and it just bums me out, she's in a walker taking her trash cans down, he said. Windsor says Abdul Jabbar went into his home but then came back out telling him that he was going to stick a knife through his teeth, a statement that Windsor though was a joke because of the relationship we've had for years. After he started to walk away, Windsor thought he felt punching, but then noticed he had been stabbed. One punch and it knocked off his glasses, I think it knocked the knife out of his hand, I'm not sure because it was dark out there, he said. Abdul Jabbar has since posted bail. Eyewitness News spoke to him briefly outside his home but he did not wish to give a statement. Windsor says Abdul Jabbar approached his wife to apologize the day after the stabbing, and added that he is worried whether he underwent some sort of psychological evaluation before he was released. A spokesperson with the sheriff's department said everyone undergoes a mental health evaluation before being booked into jail. Eyewitness News also reached out to a spokesperson for suspect's father, Kareem Abdul Jabbar, and was told he's not making statements at this time as he is still getting information. Adam, one of the basketball star's three sons, was booked on suspicion of assault with a deadly weapon and was later released after posting $25,000 bail. The investigation is ongoing. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And hit the notification bell to update you on my newly uploaded videos. Thank you.